What's up everyone, Tengu230 here, playing Sniper Elite 3, not V3, but 3. Uh, my history with Sniper Elite, uh, I played the first Sniper Elite, loved the semi-open-worldness of, of that game, I, I liked how open it was. Sniper Elite V2, obviously loved the x-ray cams, the only problem was the levels were pretty linear. So hopefully what, with uh, what Rebellion was doing in Sniper Elite 3, it's like a marriage between both of those games. You got Sniper Elite V2's X-ray cam and, you know, just shooting mechanics, gameplay and everything, along with the um, semi-open world of the original Sniper Elite. So hopefully you'll actually feel like a sniper, you know, moving around in environments and, you know, trying to get the perfect position to make an amazing shot. So. Here we go, I can't wait to play. Uh, let's start the campaign. New game, downloaded, ooh, oh yeah, I forgot I had the uh, Hitler mission on that one. But let's start a new game. Um, wow, they're unforgiving enemies already on Marksman. That's interesting, okay. So, I'm just gonna go Marksman. This is, um, actually I can probably customize, but let me just go Marksman just so I can, you know, get used to the mechanics and stuff, so. Oh, Most it just starts. Crushed under the Axis boot, forcing an Allied retreat. Their supply lines for food and raw materials are crippled. The Suez Canal is a lifeline, connecting Britain with its empire and Middle Eastern oil, making the war in North Africa crucial. As the British and Axis armies face each other across the Libyan Egypt border, the front line swings like a pendulum across the Western Desert. A harsh, unforgiving strip of land between the Mediterranean and the Sahara. Mechanized warfare has come of age. Here, tanks are king. I've arrived in Tobruk off a boat filled with replacements and reinforcements. Young men blindly rushing to their deaths. None of them are comfortable having someone like me around. Suits me fine. Most of them won't make it out of here alive. Rommel was kicked out during Operation Crusader, but Axis forces are once again sweeping across the western desert. The Gazala Gallop began with the Allied retreat, and Rommel is at the city's throat. There's no time for tactics. 35,000 of us have one order. Hold to Brook. Hold to Brook. Move your traps. Cool, that was a fast loading screen. Couldn't read anything. Interestingly enough... The game's music, wow, this is actually... Looks pretty good already. It's like Carl Fairburn is not phased whatsoever. I'm getting chills, man. It's because I'm a sniper. And I'm headed to the wall. Wow. It's a, it's shit. This game's already pretty optimized. It looks pretty good already. I forgot how to walk. Not exactly sure if I want to walk, but... It's crazy in here! Holy shit, dude! Okay, mouse to... Okay, I'm holding to look up and down. Zoom out. Am I just shooting this guy? I'm just gonna shoot him in the head. And here we go. What we're all here to play Sniper Elite V3 for. Oh, ow. Just ow, man. I forgot how to take cover in this game exactly. Am I leaving now or what? Am I just... Oh, kill this guy. Okay, that's a sniper. Woo! I don't even need to use the, uh, uh, hold breath. Oh, man. Although they're definitely not headshots. Okay, this guy. I can't see where his head is, though. I missed. Oh, wait, move to? Oh, wait, those are my troops! <laughs> it's a good thing I missed. I probably didn't miss. They just. They just, uh, don't get hit by that stuff. Whoa! Tug them. Okay, where are my objectives at? Search for more spotters. 
Oh, there's, he's, there's one over here. Okay. I'm probably gonna have to... Oh. When empty lung is used, a red, a red diamond indicates where the bullet will land, just like V2. A gray diamond indicates that the bullet destination is obstructed. That's a little new. Okay. Well... I'm gonna empty my lung. See if I can hit this guy in the head. Oh my god, it like burrowed in his skull. Holy shit, that's bad. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, okay, is that it? Killed the remaining spotter. I have to move to this spot? Come on, can I just friggin... Okay, destroy vehicles by shooting weak spots. Tag vehicles to highlight these. Some weak spots may require multiple shots. Okay, so engine block and uh, a gas thing or something. Shoot over here. Damn. And Carl Fairburn, what happened to you? Okay, you're still good. You're still alive. You just got knocked unconscious a little bit. That was a lot of freaking gunfire right there. Okay, oh cool. He you are hurt. Equip a med kit from the Okay, so hold Q and I need a med kit. Is that right? Must be stationary. Press oh, okay F. F is to use. Oh, cool! I have med. Which that's actually pretty cool. I have med kits now, and he's actually crouched like way cooler than before. Where the hell am I going? Is that like an enemy? That's a wooden plank. Objective: going up there. Find a route through the mountain pass. I shall go over here and. And be sneaky and such. This game is really way optimized. This is really good. Like, the textures look pretty nice, and I'm not even running it like on max res. So just imagine this game on max res, man. Yeah, like I said, he's actually like crouched. Like, before. I, I think it helps that the camera's like way on him or something, like right behind his back, as opposed to V2, where you can still see his feet moving around and stuff, so. Is actually pretty cool and setting wise I'm, I'm digging the setting I like it pretty cool lighting effect so far like this uh, oh some nice sun glare right there totally you blinding me approach if I crouch that's what I was doing how to switch my weapons okay there we go it, it is the uh, the mouse wheel you can probably press one two or three possibly so um, that's also an option. Let's kill this guy. What's that guy? Oh, crack your neck. Use Z to search bodies. They may have items, ammunition, or weapon upgrades. Oh, I have to hold Z to search the corpse. Okay. So I can pick up the body or swap. Don't really want to swap. Destroy the nibble buffers that eliminate the crew. Get eight kills using stealth takedowns. Okay, let me search your corpse as you slowly slide down the sandbags with your face. And you keep sliding down, that's cool. Yeah, it's exciting playing another Good sniper place game. My war rod. Good place. Same voice actor, it seems. Or I'm pretty sure. Spotting you, half yellow circle suspicious full yellow circle searching red circle attacking I think we know <laughs> icons will appear above enemies you alert these will disappear when they are attacking obviously when they're shooting they are definitely attacking which makes a lot of sense um, let's see how this is oh that didn't even look like I shot him in the head it kinda looked like it bounced off his helmet sup fellas it's daytime. It's being really quiet here. 
You know, just don't mind me. Just keep loading that nibble, Werfer. Surprise! Okay. Silent, isolated snapshots. Um, let me let me reload. <laughs> just don't notice at all. Okay. Uh, boom, boom. Okay. Die. Somebody here? Somebody's talking. I can hear something. Unless that was just some echo of him dying or something. Destroy the Nibble Waffer, eliminate or eliminate the crew. I think I'm gonna eliminate the crew. There's I didn't know there were like four Nibble Warfers. Might as well, uh. Oh, do I just automatically grab ammo? That's cool. Anything on this side? This looks. Okay. I don't think there's anything here. Unless they're down there. Nope, I don't think so. Stay hidden in a crowd. Shadows look good. Yeah, I'm playing on high. I, I, don't, I haven't tried ultra. It seems like I can probably run this game on ultra. It doesn't seem too demanding. Um, was that another? Okay, that is another crew. Yeesh. Let's head this way, I guess. It's all clear. And boom. Nobody notices. I gotta keep checking my map, keep forgetting. Uh, it looks like there's a guy over here. Okay. Is that one? Oh no, that's just like a station guy right there. Okay, he doesn't seem to see me. I'm gonna head over here and try to flank and see this guy. Um, ooh, some sounds are loud enough to mask your shots. When that icon appears, you can shoot unheard. Listen out for other sounds and time your shots carefully. Okay, well let's uh, let's use the Garen then and shoot him in the face. And let's wait for it. Let's wait for the sound. There we go. <laughs> oh, there goes his jaw. Goodbye, jaw. Okay, it's pretty cool how, right, uh, when there are loud sounds happening this time, like anywhere, it doesn't have to be like a bombing run or something like that. You can mask your sound that way, which is pretty cool, so. I don't have to wait for, like, a plane to go by. All I have to do is, uh... Wait, do I automatically get into cover? It's like there's no, uh, dedicated cover button now. Seems like I automatically pick up weapons too, so... Can I just shoot that? I mean... Ooh. I hope that sound was still going! Oh god, I have to relocate. Everybody sees me! Oh shit, get down, get down, get down. Get down! Get down on the friggin' ladder! Don't let anybody see you! They are alerted of my presence. They are alerted of my presence. Why does it gotta be daytime, man? Let's reload this sucker. Cool. Nice! Okay, I like this! This is how it should have been, man. Relocation successful. This is awesome. This is freaking awesome. Now this is how I imagined like V2 would be. I don't get what this is. Is that like a, supposed to be like a tower or something that I'm... Like I'm, I was looking at that icon um, that I just passed when I was at the tower so... I was just a little curious as to uh, what it meant exactly. Maybe it was just something in the tower I needed to grab. Cool. This is, yeah, this is a cool environment. It's not really used a lot uh, too often with a uh, with World War Two. So, is it gonna get loud? They're not. They're not loading it. Doesn't look like they're. Oh God! There's another. Oh. 
Yeah, it seems like cover's just... Cover? Do I have, like... Grenades or something I can throw? Flint and steel. Place to distract nearby soldiers or detonate explosives. What? That's kind of cool, I guess. Well, let me use it on that thing right there. So, F, right? Whoa. How did I use it? Is that Rao? Oh, what? How did you hear me? Oh, that's how it works? Oh shit, he sees me. No! So that's how flint and steel works? Okay. I thought I can throw it, but I guess I could not. Well, time to relocate. As long as he doesn't see me, I'm good. That guy is actively searching, like seriously. Alright, just getting used to the mechanics, seeing how things work. Seeing how everything works. Oh god. Hide here. You're good, dude. You are good. No need to, uh... I'm going this way. <laughs> I'm gonna hide over here, so he doesn't see me. Completing search. Let's head up here. First space to climb. Oh, he was looking that way, so I was like, wait a minute. Everything is clear, baby. Well, there's definitely someone in the tent. I, oh, there's someone down there too, but... He's looking this way. Hello. I'm gonna shoot you in the face now. Okay, so there was some sound actually that, uh, that I heard. That guy is definitely patrolling. I'll, I'll, I'll chill over here for a bit because everybody's kind of moving around right now. And... Boom! Okay. Seems like the, uh... The well rod's pretty accurate this time around. I'm glad to see that is the case. Ooh, nobody noticed that shit. <laughs> that was that was a pretty bad shot. I thought I could lead him, but I guess I was close enough to just aim for his head. Oh. Later, guys. Okay. Just don't notice your dead compatriot right there. You guys are good. <laughs> You guys are good. Just keep loading. You guys... I gotta like get a two for one while the sound's going, but there's like smoke going around, so it's like... It's like I can't exactly like see... Oh, he just turned around! Oh, right in the chin! I got promoted with that! <laughs> okay, so that blue thing is cover. In cover? Is that what? Okay, I got. Oh, I, I unlocked dynamite. Okay. I unlocked flint and steel. Does yellow mean like there's some shit going on? Like they're actively searching right now? Hopefully nobody's gonna come down this way. Oh, me, oh there we go. Search the corpse, please. Sweet. Let's keep getting some ammo. I wonder if I could shoot this. I probably could have. I mean, it seems like something I could shoot. Alright, let's uh, head back this way. I haven't vaulted yet, so let's do that. Okay, he still vaults the same way. <laughs> like his top does, doesn't even move. 
Only, the only thing that moves is the uh, lower half, like his pelvic area and everything. Seems clear. It's like, don't do the, uh, the flintstone at all. <laughs> that does not work. Let's just get a rock out. People are actively searching. That's interesting. Can I go around this way? Okay, I'm gonna try to flank on this side. Cool, it's so... It's good giving you, like, so many options to go. Like, I don't have to rile them all up. I can go to the left, try to flank them. I mean, it's all about flanking, so... You see, how the hell am I supposed to, like, get these guys from here? I mean, there's no sound, so I, I'm assuming I'm just gonna have to, like, kill him now. Oh. Here's a grenade. I don't know where that's going to, but... Uh. Uh, it's going right here. Good! Doo -doo -doo. Oh shit, I got a triple kill with that? Nice! And it. Wolverker is neutralized. I might as well check the ridge. Survey the desert beyond the mountain pass. That's cool how it made like a ramp for me. That was what the. I guess that's what the, uh, the plane was for. It's like I couldn't have climbed that myself. Even without that, uh, rocky ramp. Space to jump across gaps. Cool. Okay, that didn't work, uh, the first time. Do I have to, like, run it or something? Or just... Okay. I guess I'm not supposed to be crouched when that happens. And that's Sniper Elite 3! Okay! I don't even need, really need to, uh... That was... Just a bunch of tanks rolling in. Cool. <laughs> Collect ammo from crates or use flint. Kills. Was that 5? I, I ranked up. The Gazala Gallop. Um... I unlocked the MP40. I'm gonna skip these later on, but just... Excuse me, I just wanted to see, um... I guess how the, uh, experience and unlocking screen looks like. Marksman bonus. Okay, there we go. Killed eight enemies using cell takedowns. Didn't do that. Got 21 kills, total shot distance, relocation six? Wow, there's optional objectives, playing card, sniper nest, war dire. I missed, like, everything on that level. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, if I come across it, I'll, I'll grab it. But, I mean, if I miss it, then, you know. I'll definitely look for them, though. I'll, uh, I'll see if I can find anything shiny uh, in we the game. To Brooke, but my work had drawn the attention of British naval intelligence. They've been following one of Hitler's protégés sent to Africa, a ruthless advocate of nerve agents in the last war, General Franz Wallen. Their informant, close to Wallen, has gone dark, so they want me to investigate. My first port of call is the Gabaron Oasis, an Axis transport hub. Scout teams and commanders pass through here, along with intel. I have the cover of darkness on my side. There's a few officers in the area, so that's where I'll start my search. I can see plenty of elevation around the lake. Perfect to set up my rifle. If volan has been here, there'll be a trail. And I'll find it. Sweet. Okay, new item, Alpha. I don't know what that means. Uh, British Intelligence. Okay, I just did that. These are the weapons I have. 
Can I change my lo loadout? Oh, cool! There's an actual loadout screen, and I can, I, I can, I have different loadouts that I can save. That's cool. Yeah, that was missing from the first one. Um, I think I'll just keep what I have right now. Marksman. Oh, I can change the difficulty from here. Let's keep it marksman. So optional objectives. I'm gonna have to see if I can find those. I mean, some of the collectibles and stuff, and. You know, that, uh, like I said, if I come across it, I'll grab it. Sniper nests. Oh, cool. I can find sniper nests. That's pretty cool. Okay. Well, uh, let's just give this a start, and then after that, I'll just, like, end the episode just to see what this uh, level's like. Save often. You never know when a firefight. Wait, I can save, like, whenever I want? What the checkpoints? I can save whenever I want now? Is that right? Oh, sweet, it's a night mission. Oh, I saw a little bit of this mission in some of the previews. Cool. Alright! Let me see if I, I can save. Oh, shit, I can save. Oh, my God! An actual save slot? No checkpoints? I can make my own saves? This game is awesome, man. <laughs> Just those little things, man. Yeah, um, okay, overall, so far, first impressions, Sniper Elite 3, definite improvement over V2. Um, already the, the environments are really immersive. Uh, animations are actually a lot better, um, it seems like. And, I don't know, you actually feel like you got a chance to hide in these bigger environments. And that, as a sniper, that's exactly what you want to do. So, alright, yeah, I can't wait to play more. I know I'm playing some Shovel Knight. I still gotta finish Wolfenstein. There's a lot of games that uh, I kind of stopped playing uh, because a lot of newer games came out. But anyway, um, yeah, this is just the first part for Sniper Elite 3 uh, for the campaign. Definitely gonna play more. Uh, I'm also gonna play some Overwatch with uh, my friend Dan. Um, probably tonight uh, after I upload this video. So, uh, yeah, look forward to that. Um, Overwatch. Definitely, that's always that's, that was uh, the mode that we played a bunch in V2. So anyway, all right, this is uh, Sniper Elite 3. Well, uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe if you enjoy these videos. Um, well, until the next video of Sniper Elite 3, game on, take care. Tenga 230 out. All right, guys. See you, everybody.